Hi, I am Abhirami, Assistant Professor, Department of Computer Science, Trinity College for Women, Namakkal. Today we are going to see about the topic C language. C is a general purpose language which is very closely associated with Unix for which it was developed in Bell Laboratories. Most of the programs of Unix are written and run with the help of C. Many of the important ideas of C stem are from BCPL by Martin Richards. In 1972, Dennis Ritchie at Bell Laboratories wrote C language which caused a revolution in computing world. From beginning C was intended to be useful for busy programmers to get things done easily because C is powerful, dominant and supple language. About C C is a structured programming language. C supports functions that enables easy maintainability of code by breaking large file into smaller modules. Comments in C provides easy readability. C is a powerful language. C programs built from variable, untyped declarations, functions, statements and expressions. C programming language consists of functions, operators, expressions, statements, flow control, variables, output and C compiler. The structure of a C program. Before going and reading the structure of C programs, we need to have a basic knowledge of the following. C's character set. Keywords, the general structure of a C program, how to end a statement, free format language, header files and library function. C's character set. C does not use every character set and key found on modern computers. The only characters that C language uses for its program are as follows. A to Z all alphabets, 0 to 9 numericals and special characters. The keywords. Keywords are words that have special meaning to the C compiler. Their meaning cannot be changed at any instant. Serve as basic building blocks for program statements. All keywords are written in only case, lower case. Basic structure of C program. Hash include stdio.h and hash include conio.h. These both are the header files. Void main op. It is an entry point of a program. Curly braces indicate starting of a program. Header files. The files that are specified in the include section is called as header file. These are pre-compiled files that has some functions defined in them. We can call those functions in our program by supplying parameters. Header file is given an extension .h. C source file is, a, is given an extension .c. Main function. This is entry point of a program. When a file